Liverpool or team? England? The Swarovski England the team. Swarovski That's England right. Team yeah. USA. Yes. So are you excited? I am and, uh, and very nervous. Very nervous. Yeah, a little nervous. We got to, it's, those games that you have to win, you know, they're always the harder games. So the finals of things and, and, and internationals, they're, they're, you definitely feel this pressure that you've got to get out there, you've got to play well. And yeah, I, I like it. I like feeling like that, but yeah, it's a little nerve wracking. <laughs> I am, I like playing with her. She's good fun. She's, um, makes me play better. You know, Excellent. she's always the one that tells you, don't do that, do this. <laughs> and uh, come on that's the other one <laughs> you know? so do you prefer playing with her or against her oh with for sure <laughs> yeah against is quite hard she's a, she's so tough and so strong and she can think her sort of ability to think around a game of polo is great so she's gets there quicker and you're like how how did you do that so much how better to play you know with yeah. exactly um, i bred three of them that are here viv my colored um, she's my naughtiest but my favorite um, I'm playing her in the second chucker and then I have one called Juno who is completely bonkers with 15 legs but because of being so bonkers she actually does what she's told at the most weirdest time so she'll turn faster than any other horse because she has some for some reason a foot available to turn on so that's very handy and then my gray Lego who is just pretty perfect really so uh, I guess so I went and played in Gestad a long time ago. I think I was 22, I think, 23. And um, I was with Sonny out there. And I was meant to play for England and they changed the teams around because they thought we were too strong. And I got to play with Sonny. And it was one of the funnest weekends that I've ever had. And so I think my polo hero would be Sonny. It, she's, she's just she was fantastic to play with and she looked after me that weekend and we had so much fun but then on the other side Nina is also a bit of a polo hero because she's just so goddamn good and it's so annoying but she is and my I like I liked listening to my dad's stories you know he always had so much fun playing and was incredibly competitive but always managed to still be a bit of a gentleman at the end of it and I find that very hard to do myself I don't want to shake hands with people when I've lost and all I want to do is beat them up and I can't and so I think that I, I think I would say if I couldn't have family I would say Sunny would be my polo hero and because she just was very very good at what she did and she just pushed onwards always to be better and stronger and you never could tell you know that it was her it, I mean you could but like where that didn't matter that she was a girl or a boy she was just fantastic so I like that I think that ooh, um do it for sure um don't get put off by people you know when you're playing on the game when you're playing the game and you're playing on the field and people say oh no don't do that and don't do this it's only because you're beating them that that's why they say it so don't listen to anything unless it's your teammates don't listen to anything the opposition tell you ever ever um and be tough be strong yeah and enjoy it you know that's why you're there so enjoy it and get out there and foul really because if you foul you're in it so that's the good thing. You go and hang out and not do anything. You want to get in there, get the ball, go school goals and annoy the opposition. Yeah, definitely. And enjoy it. I think really to enjoy it. Yeah.